Hey guys, what's going on? It is Wisdom Wednesdays, and I want to talk to you about this book that I have been recommending to a lot of people. It is an amazing book that deals with growing up gay in the straight man's world, and that is the subtitle of The Velvet Rage. This is the book right here, you guys, and I want you guys to check it out. I think it's an amazing, therapeutic, cathartic read. Um, I've met many people who have read it and liked it, and I've met a few people who read it and didn't like it. And I will agree that maybe not everything in the book is something that you are going to agree with or think that it applies to you, but I think that Alan Downs, the author who has a PhD in psychology, truly hits the mark on a lot of things. And I'm not getting paid to talk about this book. I'm not being endorsed by this book. It's just something that came to me through a friend, and I read it with such clarity. It really points out the three different phases we feel as gay men. And again, he's very specific in the fact that he says this is about gay men. It doesn't have anything to do with lesbians or transgender or anyone else, but he discusses that it is something that truly is somewhat universal amongst gay men, the different stages we go through. Um, the first one he calls shame, and that is the idea that we have this overwhelming notion that we are not good enough. Therefore, we do different forms of essentially like drowning our sexuality by either becoming homophobic or just avoiding anything that could be gay or make you appear or seem gay. The second stage is the compensating for shame. And I think the second stage is where a lot of people I've met in New York and other cities around the world fall in. And it's not a bad thing, it's just you need to be aware of this stage because it's where we find false validation and almost allow our insecurities to breed our habits. And then the final stage he calls cultivating authenticity. And I kind of call this the phase where it's like internal validation, internal acceptance because it's where you no longer need all these other people telling you that you're amazing. You can look in the mirror and go, my life is good, I'm not going to be perfect ever, and all of this is okay. So if you're looking to understand yourself better, and you are homosexual or bisexual maybe, and you're dealing with um, you know, the struggles that come with figuring all of this out, I would say please go get this book. I wish there was like a fairy godmother that came down the day you came out and was like, here is this book, read it, everything will be okay, you are not abnormal, you are not wrong, everything is fine, and you will come out of this a better person. So that's it. That is my Wisdom Wednesdays. It's actually me sharing someone else's wisdom, but I think that's what life's all about, is taking things that you found that worked for you and helped you and sharing that with the world. So I hope you guys have a great rest of your Wednesday. I hope that you do decide to check out this book. And again, I know this won't apply to all my followers, but this is a book that I wanted to touch on for some time. So please go check out this book. And yeah, that's it. Again, it's The Velvet Rage, written by Alan Downs. Sorry, it's backwards. The way I film makes everything, I guess, mirrored image. But uh, I think you guys got it. And I look forward to hearing your thoughts on this book, or if you've read it, what you thought of it. Please don't forget to subscribe by clicking that little button up there. If you have a question or a comment, please feel free to leave one in the section below. I am blown away by your guys' response to my last video, which truly was a hard video for me to make. And the responses were heartfelt and sincere, and a lot of you, like I had a feeling, have dealt with similar issues, and it's been such an honor to share my story so that we can connect on these levels. Um, and last but not least, please give this video, video a big thumbs up if you liked it and you want to see more like this. That's it for today, you guys. Much love. Over and out.